Good evening, everybody. I'm Mary Love, and welcome to Country Living. It is, um, I'm not exactly sure what time it is. It's probably going on about 9 o'clock. So I was sitting here and thinking I wanted something to snack on. I got cinnamon rolls. But we're going to doctor these up like they do on TikTok. Because those are really good cinnamon rolls. I've made them a couple of times and they are so good. Um, if you hear the TV in the background, please look up. Just don't pay no mind. But anyways, let's get down here. I got my oven preheating to 350 degrees. It's now heated. So we're going to get this stuff in this bowl, this dish, and get these in the oven. Because they got to bake for 30 minutes. So let's get down here. All right. Like I said, we got one can. Now, their recipe calls for two cans, but I'm halfing it because it's just me and my husband, so we don't need that many cinnamon rolls. So, pop that bad boy open. I hope the TV's not too loud for you. He's watching a western. I'm not sure which one it is. Yeah, I'm going to have frosting all over my hands. Trying to get that out of there. Let me wash my hands off. Alright. Now, yeah, we're going to put these in here. Kind of spread them out. I may have to get me a bigger dish, y'all. Mm. That might work. Oh! Can't do that yet. I didn't spray that dish down. I was about to forget. You gotta spray it with some nice thick spray. Now we'll put them back down in there. Okay. See, I was about to mess up already. All right. In this little bowl right here, I got two tablespoons of melted butter. I got a packed little over an eighth of a cup of brown sugar. I'm going to put that in there. A fourth of a teaspoon of cinnamon. Now remember, I, I'm halving this recipe. And a half a cup of whipping cream. Or half and half. And yes, I'm using a dry measuring cup because I didn't want to go over to the cabinet and get my other one out. So a half a cup. And you want to pour that down in between these cinnamon rolls. <coughs> Just like that. Alrighty. Let me grab a spoon. So I can stir this up. Because this is going to go on top of them. I just spilt that all over my shirt. I hope it comes out. All right, we're going to spread this on top of these. I believe I spilt that on my, sh splattered that on my shirt. Mm. 
All right. Now we're going to cover this with some aluminum foil. Pop this in the oven for 30 minutes, y'all. And then we'll be back. So y'all stick around. Now would you look at just how big them things got. They look delicious. We're going to let them cool off for just a minute. And then I'll put that frosting on the top of them. Put it on there now. It's just going to melt. I'm thinking I'm going to put these back in there and let them cook for just a few more minutes without the foil on them. So we'll be back. Alright, now we're going to spread on some frosting. I think they might be cooled off enough by now. Mm. These are going to be so good, y'all. I could have made some more frosting, but to go with this, I didn't. Actually, I think this right here is going to be plenty. I wish y'all could smell these. They smell so good. Alrighty. Let me get me a saucer. Now we're going to see about getting one of these out of here. I don't think I got enough non-stick spray in that pan. Never a bill for for look at that! And that look good. Looks delicious. And it's so soft. I experienced life at St. Jude. Every dollar that goes to St. Jude goes to a good place. Keeping the family together. Yes, ma'am. The first thing I'm going to do when I get home is pet my dog. St. Jude saved my daughter's life. so soft that half and half just makes them they, it soaks up in them and they are so soft mm. Lord help me I don't want to eat another one but mmm Two thumbs up. I'll put the recipe that I went by 
in the description box. Because like I said, I halved it. So if you wanted to make the full recipe, all you'd have to do is double what I make. And you would have it. So, but anyway, cinnamon rolls. Quick, delicious. Just a little video extra for today. But with that, I will say, if you haven't subscribed yet, I sincerely hope that you do. To all my new subscribers, thank you for joining my channel. I deeply appreciate it. But with that, I will say good evening. God bless. Take care. And until we meet here again, have a wonderful evening.